Hey folks, Technivorous here. Today we are back in Lightburn. We're going to talk about laser engraving, something that is probably a little more niche, and I think you might find it interesting. It's a very useful tool, not something you'll find yourself using unless you are specifically looking for it. But maybe after I show you how it's easily editable and available, you might want to give it a shot. And that is the QR code tool. So without any further ado, let's talk some tech. We are going to go to Tools and Create QR Code. And I'm just going to drag out my size of the square that I want. And then I'm offered this Properties dialog box. And basically here, you're going to see three tabs. The first one is Raw Content. Raw Content is specifically for if you want to enter typically plain text or maybe just a URL. The Wi-Fi is going to create an access point configuration code for mobile devices. This will allow somebody to log on to your Wi-Fi network. If you're trying to work that out, all you have to do is put in the network name and password. And the other one is a contact, which basically creates a contact card code, which will load contact info into somebody's phone if they highlight it. So uh, these last two are great for business cards or signs on a workplace door. Many, many things you can do with these that are useful. I'm interested in the raw content box. So we are gonna say, you can see the QR changing down there with what I type in. Type in. And oh, I wanna be able to, I wanna spell it right here. We'll throw in my YouTube address and that is what it is it's gonna say technivorous tech reviews youtube.com slash technivorous basically here I'll go ahead and hit OK and I now have my object so yours isn't gonna show up like this and the reason for that is because I have mine selected in tools so let's go to a cutting layer to ensure that it cuts it and we can go ahead and zoom in a little bit and select it and get a preview of the burn and you can see this is what our QR code looks like so I can grab my phone here and I can scan this QR code and then all we're gonna do is open up Google Lens here on our mobile device and click search with camera. You get this handy box you can click on, and when we do that, it will look for results, and you can see our search results say Technivorous Tech Reviews with our YouTube channel. So pretty handy, pretty cool little tool. You can now burn this QR code into pretty much anything that you're capable of burning with your laser, and it will be readable and usable by people who are walking by or who it may happen to catch their eye. So really, really cool and underutilized tool. One of those things that Lightburn throws in that is it for this Lightburn video, guys. Stay tuned. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. I have plenty more videos on Lightburn tips and tricks coming out, as well as several on different things you can do with the laser that you may not know about. So if you want to be involved in those, make sure you hit the notification bell and you'll get notified every time I post a video. I also do a lot of 3D printing around here, and I'm obsessed with pretty much everything tech. So if that sounds like you, make sure you smash that subscribe button, and we will see you in the next one, guys. Technivorous out.